started a vlog here before. I'm in South Sea a lot. It's a nice um it's a nice place that's pretty well self-contained, like it has everything that you can need. And it's not intensely busy. Like where I live. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm going to I need to like cut across to the other side of the city. Eh? I should wash this bike. Gosh, this bike is so dirty. Can you see this? Like I <laughs> like look at that. I am um, oh man, it's really bright, isn't it? Such a nice day. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, wash this bike. I haven't washed this bike um, in a really long time. I bought it like three months ago. About three months ago. And I washed it twice. <laughs> I'm so bad. I washed my bike two times in three months. Two times in three months. I've also had two accidents. So, oh man. You never forget your first accident on a bike. My, my green bike, the first accident I had um, was the day I took it out. I kid you guys not. The first day I bought it, I was on campus in, in, in uni. I bought it, I took it out the first day, 6 a.m. in the morning. I was so excited, bro. I was so excited. Um, and I crashed it. Like, I, I did something weird with, like, the balancing. And then I... <laughs> I crashed it. Oh man, I'll re never forget. I even know the junction where I crashed it. Like I know everything. Gosh. But anyway, it's fine. Yeah, so that happened. Um, the second second bike, the first time I had an accident on the other bike, the big one, the red one, I was in... No, it fell. So that one has never actually had a big accident proper like the first one. It fell down. It fell down, unfortunately, because um, I didn't put the kickstand down, if that makes sense. If you have a bike, you know. So you have to put the kickstand down before you get off. So I mean, I got off without putting the kickstand down. The bike fell. It was so embarrassing. Um, and I, had, I hadn't just bought it. It was like a couple of months old. But I felt bad because I had bought it in pristine condition. So now it had a scratch, but it's okay. These things happen. Um, then this bike, I was hit by a random Chinese dude who then turned around and gave me a thousand bob. So it was, I was splitting in traffic. I guess it was kind of my fault. I don't know. I feel like it was his fault, but you know how bikers feel entitled. And they're like, yeah, we own the roads, bro. Um, so he, he cut into a lane without indicating and then he hit me and then I fell. Um, so I broke the indicator, which by the way I haven't replaced, I just put glue. You can see over here, I didn't even replace it. So I broke the indicator, he gave me a thousand shillings. He was like, sorry, 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 no English, no English. And then, because I was ready to like have a huge argument with him. But the dude didn't know any English. So, um, he tried to tell me sorry, 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 and then he just gave me a thousand bob and that was it. Like, we were done. And I was like, okay, fine. So I took the thousand shillings and uh, and that's that, done.